Yo, what's up guys and welcome back to a brand new video here on my channel and in today's video I'm going to show you all the necessary steps to improve your performance here in Fortnite Season 4 on any PC. I prepared a whole entire new pack for you guys and if you enjoyed this content please don't forget to leave a like and subscribe since I'm trying to give away a GTX 1080 at 60k subscribers and with that said let's get straight into this topic. So guys and as you can see I already prepared here for you now here a new FPS boost pack in Season 4 and you can get your hands onto it on the first link in the description which is going to redirect you to Linkvertise. By the way they are approved by others which is an antivirus guys so therefore nothing can happen they can see it already here increase fps fortnite we're going to click onto access for free and then once we get redirected you know you usually have to fulfill like maybe one or two tasks but then you can already click here onto download increase fps in fortnite then once we get it here on our desktop guys we're just simply going to launch this xc here real quick and once we're in here we're going to click onto next then decline decline because we don't want any of these like opera or something like that you know and now we got already the boost pack. It's super easy, just like that, guys, and it supports my channel a lot. So therefore, let me know down in the comment section below if this is fun for you guys. I would highly appreciate that because I'm sitting here every single day. And once we get the pack, we're going to download it. And in the first place, we're going to click it now onto ADV Cleaner, which is basically the newest version of Malware Bytes, which is going to scan a whole entire PC for malware, unwanted files, corrupted files, or anything which could somehow slow it down, guys. So therefore, we're going to click onto Scan Now. And you can see here that right now on my PC, nothing has been found because I just actually did one this morning, guys. So therefore, yeah, I'm using this program on a regular base and you can see my system is 100% fine. But what you can do, if there should be something, it will automatically repair it for you and remove those files. And once we're done with that, we now also have all these registry tweaks in here, guys. First of all, we have the game bomb windows, game mode, game recording and broadcasting and hardware accelerated GPU scheduling. And what are we going to do in the first place, guys, is click it now onto Game Bar and turn off the Xbox Game Bar, guys. Yeah, I can see still way too many people will have this turned on on their PC. This is definitely going to cost you important FPS while gaming. Then we have the game mode, which you should turn on 100%, guys. Super easy registry. If you should have any issues, you can also turn it off afterwards. But the game mode really improves your latency and system performance. Then we also have game recording on Windows and this is basically like the built-in recording software of Windows which you should disable 100%, just simply click onto yes onto this registry and should be fully disabled. And then we also have hardware accelerated GPU scheduling which we need because this improves our latency and system responsiveness. And there you can see we have two options, first of all disable and also enable and we're of course going to enable it. So therefore click onto yes and then we're already done here with this pack. And as an additional step now guys, we're going to go into our NVIDIA control panels and open it up guys real quick. Yeah, you can do by the way the same thing on AMD Catalyst because both of them are going to have some very similar options when it comes down to manage 3D settings. And what I want you to do is copy all of my settings here for the best performance guys. We have something here like the low latency mode which should turn be on, which should 100% be turned on guys. Then we have something like here, power management mode which should be on preferred maximum performance, not on anything else like normal, which is, by the way, the recommended one from NVIDIA, but we want maximum FPS, so therefore we're gonna put it on the highest one. Then we also have texture filter quality, which we're going to put on highest um, performance as well. Keep in mind, your game might not look as good anymore as before, but yeah, I mean, we just care about FPS. We wanna play a competitive game, Fortnite, so therefore we wanna have it on high performance. And just simply for the rest here, make sure that you copy every single one here, which I have in here, guys, super, super easy. I'm gonna go through it one more time. And then once we're done, you're gonna click here onto apply and then we're already done here with this step now as well. And yeah guys, if you enjoyed this video, please don't forget to leave a like and subscribe to my channel. This would help me so, so much. And if you still have any more questions, feel free to ask me them down in the comment section below. I try to answer as many as possible. And with that said, have a great day, have a great night whenever you're watching this. And until next time, stay awesome. I'm out. Peace.